Ben, found the kitchen. And of course it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that, find a window, drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilian, Sam. What? Right. So he waits to put a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? Oh, when in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. room. Not at it. <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? Sully? Great. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. believe you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> I recognize someone. No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh? Like, dead out? Oh, no. More like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan! How the hell are you? Rafe? How long has it been? Ten years? Twelve? Fifteen. 
It's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. <laughs> that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days, I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big scores. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah. I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but, um... <clears throat> Just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. See? <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel. You two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe. fight. <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? Nate? Damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this. God, why did I pick the power room? altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid, where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have 
have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. With what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here. And right right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? He won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once, going twice. Screw it. Bene, we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. You'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay, just gotta smash the lock. Now the bid has reached 130,000. Nope. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Your bid signore takes us all the way to 100,000. Gotta be something. Come on. Hey man, uh, I'm starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, give me a sec. Yes. Signore's bid makes 170,000. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. Gotcha. We are now at 190,000 euros. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid, 200,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? <laughs> Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice. Then I shall sell it for 500,000 euros. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak! Sparish. What? Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. vicino alla torre devi far cosa per tutti cazzo tieni gli occhi aperti easy
Hey, maybe we should have brought guns. Cosa? Mi sembra tutto a posto. Gotta climb and get a good vantage point. Merda, se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh, scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. No, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would... You'd what? All right, fine. Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Come on, Nathan Drake. Don't telegraph so much. I'm just trying to make it fair. Nice try. I gave you that one. the artifact. Did you know all the artifacts here are stolen? They belong in a museum. I'm really losing my patience. God. All right, look. I'm still a little jet-lagged. How about we just call it even? Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. 
If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. All right, wait, wait. It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there! Just met your friend Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> I think so. Okay. I'll meet you at the driveway. Just head towards the ballroom. All right. See you there. Big girl kind of stuck here. Any ideas? The fastest way is through the ballroom. Set the ballroom is locked down. Holy shit. Yeah. Well, now that they know it's you guys, they cleared the place out. That ballroom it is. You get that thing? Yeah. Got it. dell'aria dove diavolo si è cacciato Ugh. <sighs> 
Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Huh? Oh, yeah. Me too. Nice shot. All right, boys, change of plan. Too many people trying to leave. The driveway's all jammed up. Shit, what's our backup? There's that fountain just outside the ballroom. I'll meet you there. Got it. Let's go. for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. It's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good sign. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris in paradise. Today you will join me in paradise. paradise. It's when Jesus said to St. Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but it means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise, which means we're looking for Avery's 
grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral. But the graveyard is way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. Well, come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. Look, with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. Things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and... I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy all those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. <laughs> But it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay. I love you, too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Now, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kid. Happy hunting. Nice chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right, we'll see you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah. Just, uh... Ah, uh, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Uh, not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, it's a good place to hide. So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. Imagine what he want to do to you now. Yeah, <laughs> trying not to. Sam, listen. He's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him.
man. I've heard stories. Trust me, me too. All the more reason I don't feel bad about any of this. It's a long drop. Yeah. I need to find another way down. Hey, this should hold. Good call. <clears throat> the hell is all this? It's excavation equipment. Shoreline? What? Look. I thought they were just by the cathedral. Get out! <laughs> okay. We're good. Yeah. Nice to meet you too, Shoreline. Seems like they were expecting us. And like they're searching away from the cathedral. Which means we should get to that graveyard pronto. Exactly. Why didn't you guys search beyond the cathedral? Oh, we did, a little. This place is so big, without knowing where to look, like shooting in the dark. Or like blowing shit up in the dark. <laughs> what is this place? Monks had several living quarters. Main one being by the graveyard, of course. <laughs> yeah, location, location, location. <clears throat> More shoreline equipment. Uh, at least no shoreliners. Now, what do you bet? Yep. Dynamite. Yeah, be careful with that stuff, huh? <sighs> hey, got the door open. How was... Very loud. Hopefully they didn't hear us. Uh, hopefully we just blend in with the other explosions. Look, there's a way up through the roof. Oh, let's find something to climb on? Yeah. Use this to climb out of that building. Take that, Dor. You're pretty good with that stuff. Well, I've blown a lot of shit up over the years.
Nicely done. That could have been bad. Yeah. Let's get out of here before anyone checks in on them. There. Come on, let's go. 